Oh, no, that was really I'm using the camera's reflection to, you know what I'm doing. You've been here before. You know how us narcissists are. We're running a million miles a minute right now, but yeah. I appreciate you giving me dress, bro. No, it, it feels great to see you wearing Givenchy Thanks, just cause bro. like you're coming up. Next up, I love your music and you just have like great style. It looks effortless on you. I appreciate that, man. Yeah. I know you've been showing love from a distance for a while. But I think the, the chocolate's nice, right? The color's my favorite better, part. The color it matches black. my hair. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate you. Thank you for real. I dressed so horribly in high school. It wasn't until recently that I became vain and concerned with how I look. Some Carhartt pants and then some New Balance 550s. Well, this is Louis. This hoodie's Louis. You know, I don't have too much going on typically. And I wear, I like to wear black. I like to wear solid colors. So the only thing for me to tweak is how much lint is on me generally. Yeah, it's my only watch really. I mean, I have other. This is my only Rolex. I wear this all the time, every day. These. Whoever wants them. Drake's on the album, yeah. I always had a strange confidence at an early age. So, um, I definitely believed I would work with Drake when I bought Thank Me Later. He did his verse right in front of me. Um, which pretty much just further solidified his greatness to me. There's certain songs, there's beats, where no matter what I'm wearing in the studio, the beat, you know, transforms me into a different fit, you know, depending on how I feel. A lot of the beats I rap on are very expensive sounding and luxurious, so, you know, I, I picture myself in cashmere sweaters and suits while I'm in the studio all the time because it just fits the music. So, you know, I think there's some time, you know, there's a connection between everything. I think definitely there's one there. I, I mean, I, you just, growing up on social media, you catch wind of the Met Gala, but it definitely seems like this distant, highest level thing, you know what I'm saying? And maybe that's what it is. It's cool to walk inside and see what it's about. I feel like I look like a beetle. I like it. <laughs>